I don't even know how to word it without getting emotional. Um, one thing that stood out to me immediately upon arriving to our, our first site um, was just the joy that people had for us coming to spend time with them. And El Salvador really personally has won over my heart and I didn't realize how one common language that we all have as humans is love. And when you feel that from a complete stranger, every time, every different like place, it, it, it gets to me and it's truly one of the best feelings I've ever felt in my life. I got to watch uh, children perform here and lead in uh, music worship and this is something that I have been able to do in my life. I've been able to uh, lead kids space dancers in my church and I got to see children play instruments in an incredible way but there um, could be more. I felt an intense desire like okay I want to resource this music ministry because music so important and I would love to see the music ministries in these communities grow. Saludos a todos de El Salvador. Uh, my name is Nelson Mont. I'm actually half Salvadorian. It's been incredible to, to tell people I'm half Salvadorian, but my circumstance is so different than yours. Um, and, and they're looking at me like, oh wow, you're half Salvadorian. Maybe I, ha maybe I have some hope. Maybe this is not my, my forever situation, um, which is one of the things that I told one of the kids. Um, so I'm just blessed. I'm blessed that I can come here and say I'm half Salvadorian, but hey, where I'm coming from, uh, it's much different than here, so there's hope for you, you know. This was an opportunity to focus solely on helping others, um, solely on giving and contributing to others with no ulterior motive other than uh, other than to just provide hope for people. But even just the act of booking the trip um, immediately shifted my focus from my day-to-day -day problems to learning more about the problems of, of people in, in other countries. And, and then the second that I stepped foot in San Salvador, um, it was just magnified tenfold. When we come into these churches and we're complete strangers to each other, and you look into each other's eyes and you can see the gratitude that they're giving us for being there, that is what really gets to my heart every time, is how we can actually connect with a complete stranger through God's love. There's 36 of us on this trip. Whether you feel like you wouldn't make a difference because you don't speak the language coming to these marginalized places, you do make a difference and you do matter. I had some, some hesitations and some reservations of coming on a trip, um, going out of the country, taking three to four business days away from my business, um, you know, five to six days away from my family. The second I stepped off the plane, all that went out the window. Um, I wouldn't trade this experience for the world. We put so much work into what we do. Mortgage, the mortgage industry is very, very hard. You know, it's, it, it occupies a lot of our time. And it's hard to see the benefits of everything that we pour out every single day. Um, so if you're ever questioning, what am I doing? Why am I here at Movement? Uh, to get the, the best answer, you have to come here and serve others. The people that come on these trips are incredibly gifted, the leadership at pulling you into roles where you get to serve, you get to be a part of it in the way that you are. And that's just phenomenal. I've been able to feel like such a part of something bigger than myself. If I could tell any movement employee why they should come, it would be definitely just to see a small part of the vision that Toby and Casey Crawford saw when they probably started this initiative. To have a heart to love and value people is extremely rare. Extremely rare. Um, and in an industry that's notorious and, and has a bad reputation for taking advantage of people, movement from the top down has a, has a, a mission to do the exact opposite. It's something else to be able to actually see where our profits are going as a company and it's something super proud to be a part of. And if you can get a small taste and a small sense of why we do that, um, again, it'll impact your life forever in the most positive way. Uno, dos, tres. Move it!